morning beautiful people and happy monday i'm having my breakfast right now i do have a youtube next up training at 10 a.m and actually my uncle and my papa are going to start to work on the fence so they're starting here at the back but the materials is still not here so we're gonna have to wait for that all right my breakfast for today is one toast there you go and one egg and <laughs> you know what it's so funny because whenever me and tom talk he always like eats one toast and i'm like Baba, do you not like eat two toes? Because there's like two slot in the toaster, you know? And he was like, yeah, you can actually just put one bread in there. And he showed me the toaster that he got. There's like six slots. And I was like, oh, really? I thought there's like only two slots for a toaster. But yeah, anyway, let's eat everyone. Bon appetit. with my breakfast and it's super hot today in an hour i'm going to start my youtube next up training i told my papa already to not disturb me from 10 to 12 because that's the time frame that i will be on the meeting and yeah i told them to just try to cook themselves their lunch because they might be hungry already as soon as i finish at 12. in the meantime i'm going to show you what we are currently working on they are starting here at the back area and then yeah we're gonna work their way around going to the front we're still waiting for the materials i don't know what's causing the delay i paid it already but yeah anyway um let me show you the outside look how hot it is already it's only nine in the morning here we're gonna go at the back because this is where we're gonna start digging some holes so papa has started digging already i'm going to align it with this um area here going there okay so let me show you we have here the holes that's where we're gonna put the wood and then i think it's 10 10 feet apart from each other i'm not so sure and then there's another one here and then over there and then yeah we are going to put the fence all the way into this plant over here and going there as well so we are going to put this water tank inside so at the back of that that's where the fence will be then it goes there as well so yeah you guys will see that later on but for now uh, my papa is working on digging some holes so that once the materials will be here then they can just you know put the stuff in Hello everyone, so I just finished with my training. That is my setup right there. <laughs> okay, I thought it was like two hours, but it was only for one hour and we'll be back later at 1 p.m. So I still have two hours and with that being said, I can definitely like cook lunch for papa and my uncle so i'm going to show you guys what's the current situation here outside how is it looking um we're gonna start here in the front because i've showed you guys already how does it look in the back all right guys so this is how it's looking in the meantime it is 11 a.m right now it's super hot but here we go so the plan is to start here if you guys can see there's this straw um so my uncle is trying to measure everything already so that's where we're gonna put the metal since this is in front and then we have one over here as well from this wood that you can see here and this one this is actually where the gate will be so if i look at it right now it actually looks like really small and looks like the car will not fit in but we'll see later because my uncle already measured that gate and this is how it looks all right so here it goes all all the way here that's the road and then it's gonna end here this is like the very corner this one and then it goes all the way there as well so it is a pretty big like area that we are going to fence i would say and yeah here we go we have here like a hole that my dad started digging in he's using like this one you guys can see there's another hole here so this is another corner it goes there and over there as well so yeah ta-da my front garden will be inside and my water tank as well so there you go 
My uncle went to the hardware store to get the materials so that they could already deliver it. There's such a delay. You know, welcome to the Philippines. <laughs> Okay, so right now I'm going to cook lunch for us. I will have chicken, stir fried chicken with carrots and potatoes because this is the only one that I got. I thought that I still have shrimp here, but I think we cooked everything the other night. So yeah, come on, let's cook. I still have two hours free time before I get back to my training. just finished with my YouTube next up afternoon session. I'm just here at the front of mom's store, the sitting area, and my battery is blinking. <laughs> photo B <laughs> talking to Tom at the moment I'll get back to you guys later Scarlett, come on. Where are you? Where are you going? Nana store. Nana store. Okay, so we are going to harvest Nana's video key machine. It's the 15th of November. So every 15th of the month, we are going to harvest the inside of the video key. What's wrong? Is it nice? <laughs> Look at that. Let's get inside of the polyman the video key machine. So we're going to count how much is it. <laughs> Oh, 
So the video K for one month of singing here in the countryside is in total to 2,000 pesos or 4, 40 US dollars. <laughs> Good morning, beautiful people. This is the next day. I just finished with my YouTube training. So today is second day and I'm really learning a lot. I love it so much. Thank you so much, YouTube, for doing this. Anyway, finally, all of the materials for the fence have arrived. I'm going to give you guys a really quick haul. All right, we're going to start from here. We have one sack of cement and six sacks of sand. So Papa is going to pour some water in the middle and yeah, he's going to mix that one out. Over here, in this area you guys will see the interlink so this is how it looks when it's not being stretched out so yeah it's actually not so heavy I was expecting it to be stretched out already but it looks like that so again that's 10 pieces of interlink and the size is 4 feet by 10 feet and then here we have this really expensive <laughs> round kind of metal pole that we're gonna be using here in front of the house so that it will look good so this is three the measurement i believe and then yeah we're gonna cut that in half because that's pretty long over here you can see we have here five two by two wood and yes this is where we're gonna attach the gate in the front now on this side you can see we have this bamboo so we call this one guod in besaya Alright guys, so now it is currently 11 in the morning and so I'm going to cook some lunch for us. Um, I do have another session though. It's one-on-one -on -one at 2 p.m. So yeah, I still have 11, 12, 1, 2, yeah, 3 hours uh, vacant. And by the way, I got this Senor Pedro Lechon Manok or roasted chicken from the city last night. We did not eat this one for dinner <laughs> because I really wanted to cook this one today. people so I just finished with lunch I'm quite productive today actually I think because of YouTube next up I felt like I'm so motivated to work to do more videos to upload videos and yeah <laughs> anyway so we have here there you go looks so nice actually super good um lechon manok paksio roasted chicken paksio and we did not finish it it's only me papa and my uncle so I'm going to put this in the fridge and maybe we're gonna have this one for dinner later or for their snacks. So snacks in the Philippines is not like bread or pizza or whatever, you know, some people, especially if they're working in like the construction or like farming, normally they will have rice. <laughs> Ta-da! There you go. So we'll put this in the fridge. And I know for sure that Scarlett wants to eat this one for later. Maybe they're gonna come here later on. Okay, so I do have, I think, 45 minutes before my one-on-one -on -one session. So I'm gonna get back to you guys later. This is how the back door is looking. And this is where the fence is gonna be. So we have here one, 
another one here two three and it goes all the way there in this plant again that i have showed you guys yesterday goes all the way there we have one two three so let's go in the front here in the front of the house this is where we can see all of the bamboo that they've already put as well you guys can see at the very corner we have one two three and then here four five six so it stops there and actually this is not the corner we have the corner here but if you guys can see it still doesn't have any bamboo in there because we're going to be using the metal you know goes there right so this is the metal that we're going to be using i think we need to use like a grinder to cut it off into three so everyone we have another update so they were able to finish putting all of the metal and wood around the house so obviously we have to wait for it until it gets really sturdy because we had to put cement and sand so that it will be very strong <laughs> so they're there i think they're gonna try to put the interlink we have some kids here saira margo hello and Luis. we have carlo and john mark as well say hi everyone <laughs> they're chilling in here so yeah this is how it looks there you go so this is our main gate guys let's get inside our gate this is how it looks it looks so small in the camera actually but i think my car is like you know it's a sedan it's very small so i think it will fit it's just that so when we open the gate it's gonna open going here right so when i enter here i think i need to go drive there first and then i'm gonna go back up going to the garage yeah what do you guys think right because i think i will have a hard time to just try to get in and go directly in there because there will be like a the gate here i'm gonna try that one out once they finish like putting the interlink i think tomorrow because yeah as you guys can see it's here we have to wait until that gets dry return 500 us for one way that's a lot no or is it really like that it's it's really like that <laughs> why is mine so like expensive yeah so this is the only problem it costs so much like the flight normally from from philippines to like thailand it would only cost you i don't know three thousand pesos 30 us no that's not 30 um 60 yeah and it's like a thousand i don't know why why do they like charge so, so much wherein i need to go to singapore anyway and there's already a lot of flights from singapore there might not be flights from there, I, I think all international flights now has to go to manila first so that they could add more passengers from there Probably. I don't really like to go to Manila Airport to be honest. I have like a trauma there. Good evening everyone! So today is the day, tonight is the night that we are going to have mom test drive or yeah, she's gonna drive my car for the very first time. So yeah, there she is. <laughs> are you ready? So we're doing it at night because she's working during the day, you know? Seatbelt! Uy! Gas, do mai. Hmm, relax lang. Break, break ka mai. Make sure lang simulin ha. Gas. Ay motor ha, kanina ana ko dapat. <laughs> 